A list of traffic infringements is received by the transport department. For each infringement on the list, an issue infringement notice task is created. These tasks run to completion in parallel and do not trigger any subsequent tasks. They do not need to be synchronized at completion. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on BPMN and workflow patterns. Today we look at the multiple instance without synchronization pattern. Within a given process instance, multiple instances of a task can be created. These instances are independent of each other and run concurrently. There is no requirement to synchronize them upon completion. You can see the behavior in the original flash animation. So here in the flash animation we have A and then B creates no instances in the first iteration here. Um, in the second iteration B creates one instance of B and then C is completed. In the next iteration B creates two instances and in the third iteration B creates three instances. How can we implement that in BPMN? The workflow patterns book says that in BPMN you have to set the variable behavior to none. I couldn't verify any of this in Camunda. I have created a small workflow with a list of two infringements received. In order to continue as soon as possible we need to set the completion condition to true. However, this condition is first evaluated after the first multiple instance work item is completed. Therefore, the process does not go immediately to manage other transport issues as would be required in the pattern. Instead, it waits for someone to work on one of the multiple instance work items. When we complete the first multiple instance work item, we get the situation as shown here. We can now manage other transport issues, but the second multiple instance work item has been cancelled. This is all very nice and conforms to the BPMN 2.0 specification, but we didn't implement the workflow pattern. As a side note, YAWL behaves exactly like Camunda in this case. If we really want to manage other transport issues and not wait for the issuing of the infringement notices, what can we do? We can simply use a parallel gateway as shown here. This may look like a workaround, but let's take another look at the first version. The sequence flow between issue infringement notices and manage other transport issues suggests that the second task can only start when the first one has been finished. If it were possible to implement this workflow pattern with this diagram, this would be a contradiction to the sequence workflow pattern. So the second version represents in a much clearer way that we don't want to wait for the completion of the multiple instance task. Don't you agree? Thank you for watching.